U.S. stocks closed higher on Thursday, winning back much of the previous day's losses as economic data continued to fuel optimism that the Federal Reserve would ease monetary policy. The Dow added nearly nine-tenths of a percent. The S&P 500 gained one percent, while the tech-heavy Nasdaq climbed 1.3 percent. The bounce back in stocks came one day after all three indexes sank more than 1 percent, snapping a multi-session rally. It was yet another sign of what Nancy Daoud, private wealth manager at Opus Advice First, says has been a central theme of 2023 staying the course. There were a lot of investors that really kind of gave up in September and October because things were so dismal and everything was really taking a dive. There was a great deal of volatility. But if you didn't stay the course, if you are not fully invested over the last six weeks up until Tuesday, of course, if you got out in October, you just missed a period of six weeks where the market rose by 15%. And that could make a dramatic difference for your lifetime, actually, not just for a year or two. In company news, shares of Micron technology jumped more than 8.5% on signs of a memory chip recovery in 2024 after one of the most significant downturns in years. American electric vehicle makers Tesla, Lucid Group, and Rivian Automotive rose between 1.6 and 3 percent after a report said the U.S. was considering tariff hikes on Chinese EV manufacturers. And shares of Nike, up about 1 percent at the close, shed about 11 percent in after-hours trading after the company missed quarterly sales estimates due to a weak North American wholesale business and feeble recovery in China. In economic data, a Commerce Department report showed the U.S. economy grew at an annualized rate of 4.9 percent last quarter, revised down from the previously reported 5.2 percent. It was still the fastest pace of expansion since the fourth quarter of 2021. Friday brings the Commerce Department's Crucial Personal Consumption Expenditures, or PCE, report the Fed's preferred inflation gauge.